first time you go into Scan Pet, you're going to want to set up your preferences. Now you can see that we haven't used it yet because Continue File and Send Receive are black. Once you've used it, you're going to see that these colors will change. So the first thing we're going to do is go into our preferences. Quite a few items to look at here. The one I want you to focus on is Excel Columns. We'll deal with Send Receive here in a little bit. Excel Columns. Now if you leave all of these up, what's going to happen is you're going to have to actually input something for each one of these. The only thing you want is the barcode and to be able to move forward. So the first thing we do is we delete all of these columns except the barcode. If you accidentally delete a column that you don't want to delete or if you decide you want to use one of these, you can simply select Add, Add a Column. We'll delete this last one. So now we just have barcode. That's the only thing we want. When we go out it's going to say there's an error, but we don't have to worry about that. There's not actually an error. The next thing you want to set up is your send receive. Now you can set it up in Dropbox, Google Drive user, email address. These are the primaries that you're going to be sending it to. So the Google Drive user, this one is Shell's, my lovely wife. So we're going to select Shell and say OK. The next one is setting up our email address. The Google Drive account link has been done. We've set the email address up for Shell's email and we say OK. Now the email has been set up. So when you go to uh, download any of these off your phone, you can either email them to yourself, you can send them through Dropbox or through Google Drive.